One look and you can see why a young couple might want to get married here. This, for what we need, looks perfect. It looks perfect. Megan Carney and Avery Seltzer liked it so much, they decided to push up their wedding date to August 4th. So she made it happen in, you know, four and a half months, which was huge. Um, and then it un un unraveled on Monday. You know, I said, Avery, um, something's not right. It's not right. Uh, they're not getting back to me. Something was wrong. The vacant property was being used as a for-profit business by Angela Kahn. So the city informed the property owner that she needed to apply for a variance to the zoning order to use the property as a rental, but never received any paperwork. I finally got a phone call, and it was from the owner, Angela Kahn, and she said, um, I can't have your wedding. I'm sorry, but it's just not happening. She called me, and immediately right when I answered the phone, I knew something was wrong just by you know, the tone in her voice. The mustard seed stepped in, offering another venue. People in Indiana are just so genuinely nice and caring. But? Avery, I think I just broke my ankle, and he said, no, you didn't. Get up. <laughs> <laughs> I was so, I was in such panic. I was like, this cannot be happening right now. And, uh, oh, it did. Yeah. So now, the young couple can start planning for 2019. Next Saturday is going to be a really hard day for me, and probably for Avery, since that was going to be, so... Probably need some support <laughs> on that Saturday. It's really, really hard to think about. In Hamilton County, Kevin Rader, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.